Hey everyone, I'm Megan O'Leavy, and here's what you need to know for your UFC Minute. It came as a shock to the MMA community when this fighter left her longtime gym recently. But that surprise was nothing compared to the reaction felt around the globe when she agreed to fight her longtime training partner in a compelling matchup that highlights this weekend's UFC card at Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. That's it for today. Stay tuned for your next UFC Minute, and I'll see you at the fights. Coming up next, it's a UFC women's bantamweight division matchup. Well, for a long time, she has been one of the best 135 pounders in the world, and now tonight, her biggest opportunity to date to prove it title eliminator she wins tonight she has been guaranteed a shot at the ufc women's bantamweight championship division relatively wide open she doesn't believe that way she feels like she is the best and there is a long line between her and the rest tonight her opportunity to prove it in front of her biggest audience today this girl has ridiculous All right, here is the undisputed UFC Women's Featherweight Champion, Chris Cyborg. She is as cerebral a fighter as she is strong. Every skill in the book is a skill that she possesses. Tremendous cardio as well. And when you're fighting 25 minutes every time out, that is a skill you need to lean on at times. Won't be an issue for Chris Cyborg if she has to visit those championship rounds here tonight. This girl is an expert Muay Thai practitioner. Her kickboxing is at an extremely high level. Her knees and elbows are things. And here is tonight's tale of the tape. More than five years apart, some differences in height and reach. You ready to fight? You ready? We are underway. All right, so here we go early round one with her winning streak in tow. She has now arrived at her first title eliminator. She has never competed in a number one contender fight at the UFC. She has worked hard to get here, and now the focus, don't throw it all away. If she can win this fight tonight, she has been guaranteed a shot at the UFC Women's Bantamweight Championship. So, she understands the... Wow! This could be it! strike here to end the fight early in the first. Yeah, Joe, outstanding technique by her to land that shot and finish the fight here in the first round. Sometimes when you catch a fighter cold before she's had a chance to get going in the fight, it can have a more pronounced effect. That is certainly the case in this fight here tonight. What a result, what a knockout. And let's take a look at that from a different camera. Well, that's a knockout they'll be talking about for quite some time. What a moment for this fighter here tonight. Back inside the arena now, we go inside the octagon where Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 50 seconds of the very first round. We're playing the winner by knockout, well, she's got all the tools, Joe, and she certainly put them to good use tonight as she gets the win and gets so with style points by way of the knockout. No judges needed for this one, and you can be sure her bankroll is going to be fatter on Monday morning. She'll probably get a bonus. At the very least, though, the celebration is on. You see there with her coaches and her teammates. Nothing.